We are officially in the 230s. It's getting real. <laughs> Just get crazy. Like when you start to really see like your body transform, you can really transform your own body. These are the pants that I could not fit at all. I couldn't even buckle them up. Y'all. <laughs> I can fit them now. These are the shorts, y'all. <laughs> that I can't fit. For the gram. Bitches love the gram. Oh, wait, shit. Hey guys, welcome back to another weight loss journey vlog. We are currently in the car. About to go to one of our favorite tracks basically for the majority of the week y'all i've been feeling so good because it's finally starting to feel like fall in houston it's saturday um the 25th it is day 19 y'all it's day 19 of our omad and intermediate fasting diet it's crazy this month went by so fast I haven't been going anywhere I've just been at home really determined to finish this 30 days highly motivated and I'm finally off my cycle TMI so I've just been feeling good it feels good to get up and like have like energy I didn't used to have like energy I used to like just want to be lazy so this is the park isn't it is so freaking pretty and it literally goes through so many woods has the shades and like i said it's starting to feel really like fall in houston so imagine the shade and the breeze <laughs> such a good run <laughs> all right back from the track y'all it was a good run i think we ran about two and a half miles hit some of my goals that i was going for so i'm happy about that before i lost my 40 pounds or whatever before i even started my weight loss journey i used to hate taking pictures y'all every time someone would try to take my picture or tell me to take a picture or like take a video of me i would dead ass be like no i used to really hate like how i looked i could take my own pictures because i know my angles when someone else is taking a picture it's like from a different perspective and i didn't want to see myself in that light now that i'm like on this journey and i'm losing weight i really understand that taking pictures are very crucial it shows like your hard work six months from now i'm gonna have all these pictures showing my progress showing my journey because sometimes the scale is not going to tell you how much hard work you've been putting in sometimes the pictures is the only thing that's going to show you your hard work so take pictures y'all i had a good workout 20 more minutes until my 16 hour fast is up 
So, I'm gonna make me a smoothie, my favorite. This rubber band is on my camera because my viewfinder is broken. Six minutes left, well, five minutes now. Three bags of these, this how it looks. These things come in little bags, look. I did not know that. Go get you a bag. Open this, pour it in there, and that's your proportion of mixed berries and oatmeal. Highly recommend. I did tell you guys that it is in the flavor vanilla, but I didn't tell you guys it was in the flavor vanilla ice cream. I feel like you guys really need to know that because it's a difference between vanilla and vanilla ice cream. So y'all, this is so good, y'all. These are the pins that I could not fit at all. I couldn't even buckle them up. Y'all. <laughs> I can fit them now. Seriously. Ah! One more pair of shorts that I could not fit at all in my closet. Once I can fit them, sis, oh, it's over. <laughs> I can't fit. I can't fit them at all. I cannot button one single button. But when I can. Uh, lately I've been just so emotional. Like really, really emotional. The last time you guys seen me, I didn't finish vlogging because my family had this trail ride. And um, I decided to go to the trail ride with my family. I got a little too lit, just living in the moment. About to be five o'clock in the afternoon. I'm trying to be much nicer to myself. I'm trying to understand that this is a journey. Yesterday I ate like some fish and shrimp. Yeah, some fish and shrimp and some boudin. Like the old me probably would have like thought about that all night yesterday, all morning today. Like I would have literally just thought it into like a depression back to grind mode but i have to like tell myself it's okay to take days to go out with your friends or your family i set my timer before i went out with my family last night this is what i love about iphone my phone went dead y'all and then when i woke up the next morning and i charged it the timer was still going so yeah i had my smoothie or whatever i'm about to get emotional right now like why why do you want to cry sis what's really going on i'm changing mentally like i feel like i'm getting stronger physically i'm starting to gain more confidence and i'm just starting to see a lot of things that i didn't see way back <laughs> when i was very sad and depressed and just going through it this journey is really becoming like a form of therapy for me and i just can't wait to like be able to come back and look at these vlogs and like really be like wow like i've came so far just wanted to have a little mental chat with you let you guys know where i'm at but um yeah i'm about to go to walmart it is sunday day 20 it's some leftover salmon and mashed potatoes so um that's just what i'm gonna have for tonight slowly but surely losing my stomach and i'm like <laughs> freaking out about it y'all i'm not even gonna lie <laughs> these sweats used to be a little bit tight on me um you guys can go and watch it it was in my sheen haul look at that let me move my hair out the way so you guys can see uh it's getting blurry y'all look at that this is not sucking it in. You start to see your body transform. It gets really crazy. I want to go harder because I really want to see how I can transform my body. Like, you can really transform your own body. I'm very proud of myself. We're doing it. It's getting done. All right, you guys. So I just got back from Walmart. So I bought me some flowers. But really, I don't have my card. I got... I got my fiance's car, y'all. So he really bought me some flowers. It brightens up the living room, but it also, let me cut this damn thing down. But it also 
makes you feel better. Got me my personal stuff right here. The makeup that I had on last night, I still have it on because my mascara is waterproof and it won't come off. But yeah, these are my flowers that I bought yesterday. They're so cute. That's what I'm having for my meal. Um, I'm not going to eat all the mashed potatoes, but this is just how it is in this Tupperware. Probably just eat like only like a little bit of the mashed potatoes. Hey guys, so it is Monday, day 21, I think. I didn't really vlog a lot this day because I was having a lot of copyright issues on my channel. And basically the majority of the day I was trying to get rid of that. But yeah, super sorry. I didn't get a lot of footage. Sorry about the angle. I was sitting in here watching motivational videos. I wanted to share this with you guys because it has helped me a lot of times like a lot of times i done felt like unmotivated or just discouraged my mom used to randomly just send me motivational videos and i would watch the videos and by the end of the video y'all i would be bawling my eyes out because i would be so like it just it clicks with something in me and it makes me emotional but it also makes me motivated so what i've been trying to do on my own is when i feel unmotivated or depressed or sad or just my energy is off I try to like do stuff that I know is going to you know help me in that department instead of sitting in it because usually that's what I do if I get sad or depressed I will literally sit in that sadness basically like waste away my whole entire day so I decide not to do that anymore because doing that doesn't get me anywhere like literally it gets me nowhere I highly recommend to watch motivational videos y'all now step on the scale i used to think about i wouldn't think about how far i've came i would think about how far i have to go and if that makes any sense because sometimes i'll be talking in circles but i just used to think so negative so now i think of it like damn i would rather be where i'm at right now than to be where i was when i first started like I was almost 300 pounds and I'm just happy where I'm at right now. Celebrate the small goals that you set. Celebrate the small steps that you have accomplished. You just have to think of it as, damn, I'm way farther than where I was when I first started. And this is, this is my world. The motherfuckers is living in. September the 28th and it is the 22nd day of our OMAD yay you guys know that I always check my weight on Tuesdays because I started on Tuesdays so I just decided to check my weight on Tuesdays so today we are going to be checking my weight you guys know I always journal so I always keep up with to date on my last vlog I was 240.9 I'm about to step on the scale right now and see how that goes it's an hour until my fast is <laughs> broken it's actually 1 30 in the morning oh, why I say 1 30 in the morning it's actually 1 30 in the afternoon I always check Zyla weight first because she hops on it before I can even get on it so um yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to check her weight like we always do. <laughs> we are officially in the 230s. Why? It's getting real. <laughs> yeah. 238.5. Yay. I'm so close, y'all. I started this almost 250 pounds, y'all. And now I'm 238.5. I'm so happy, so proud of myself. Hopefully by the end of this month, I could get down to my goal weight, which is 235. That was my small goal for, you know, basically the month of September. I lost 10 pounds, y'all. 10 pounds lighter, I feel 10 pounds lighter. I feel good, okay? So that's all that matters. <laughs> I'm just so overwhelmed because 
these 10 months that I've been on my weight loss journey, y'all. I done started something and I always never really finished it. The fact that I'm gonna be able to say that I finished 30 days, I'm just really proud of myself. Like, I, the old me would have never finished past the first week. This is what I usually do early in the morning. I track my stuff in my journal. I'm going to end this vlog here, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for supporting. It really means so much that people are interested in my weight loss journey and is cheering me on. And I don't know, it really motivates me to see that other people are just like, get it, girl. This is only the beginning, okay? It's only the beginning. And you guys already know the motto. Walk by faith, not by sight. Love one another, be kind to one another, and to be positive because positivity always wins. Thumb up this video if you guys love the weight loss vlogs. And do not forget to subscribe and join my journey, y'all. It's Thank just you. getting started. I decided to dedicate six months to just working on me, eating healthy, working out, and just trying to be my best self. And um, I'm gonna see where that takes me. I feel good, I feel great. And yeah, I will see you guys in the next weight loss vlog. It's gonna be our last week of OMAD. And we're gonna go hard. And hopefully we get to celebrate a big milestone of me finally reaching my small goal of 235. Officially 42 pounds down. Yay.